Hi, Eric. Um, thank you so much for coming tonight. My name is Abby, and my question is this. Uh, if you tomorrow you know, had to walk away from the, the business entirely, but I gave you a couple million dollars and said that you could start any other business you want, what would you start, and where do you think the opportunity for the next big thing lies? Wow. <laughs> wow, my goodness. You're supposed to tell me that. Someone, I was told by David that someone here is starting the next Facebook. This is not true. All right. Um, so, uh, no, I, I, I tell you generally, I think that generally speaking, I think there's going to be, there's, we're in the midst of another big boom cycle. Um, and obviously, there are very real trends that are driving it. So I'd say you have, um, uh, you have basically um, internationalization, sort of mobile, that you know, the whole world's got mobile devices, phones, and pads, and social, which is basically like Facebook, right? Which is effectively becoming a communication platform that's you know, going to continually dwarf other things. So if, it, w if I were to then think thematically about what I would look at, I think a lot of money is going to be made on Facebook um, you know, in various ways. I know that's a broad thing. And if I told you specifically, I'd have to kill you. But um, <laughs> it's, uh, you know, I would say that if you look at Facebook, you know, Zynga, which is a gaming company, um, has, you know, Gush's money has been phenomenal. I think that's just sort of the tip of the spear and that it's been figured out for games. I think people figured out for media, commerce, and other things. In other words, I think it feels very much like the internet in 1997. You know, there's going to be a lot of businesses. So I, I would probably focus very much on start to generate ideas by focusing on those types of platforms. What I, what I would tell you, though, um, as well, is that it's very hard to sort of just sort of go into a room and say, I want to be an entrepreneur. Best idea by Saturday wins. It's a lot, a lot of people do that. And they're just like, well, I'm not going to take a job. I'm going to be an entrepreneur. Best idea wins by Saturday. It's a little bit more opportunistic. So what I might do as an approach is whether you agree with what I'm saying is a trend or something else, say, all right, if I agree with that trend, let me first get some experience in a job for a couple of years. Where can I learn as much about that area? And then as you're working through it, the specific ideas will, will uh, present themselves. Because you'll be living through, you'll say, why is it done this way? Well, that doesn't make sense. Every client we worked at here was asking for this. And then you go, I should start a business. So, I, you know, so unfortunately can't, you know, no, no blinding insights more than that. And it's probably obvious because pretty soon the janitor at Facebook will launch a company and Google will buy it within a week. Um, so, but I would, I would not underestimate how much money and how many businesses are going to be started on the Facebook platform.